Welcome back to the broadcast center stage at the IEC general meeting. And right now with a very special guest, this year's winner of the Lord Kelvin Award. Since the early 90s, he's an expert for electromagnetic compatibility in IEC CISPR and was responsible for essential innovations in standardization as vice president technical in Senelec. Welcome, Uwe Kampet. Congratulations. This year you have been awarded for the highest IEC award, the Lord Kelvin Award. Mm -hmm. This is a great honor as only one individual out of hundreds of potential IEC experts will receive the award um, once a year dur during this general meeting at the IEC general meeting. What were you thinking and, and feeling when you first received the message that you will be the winner of the award? I was happy and proud, uh, in particular because this award was not only dedicated to my standardization activities, but also to the conformity assessment activities. Standardization and conformity assessment are two sides of a coin. With this award, the IEC recognized is exceptional long-term achievements. Which achievements were these? I would uh, like to focus here on two achievements. The first one is what you already mentioned, uh, my standardization activity on electromagnetic compatibility in, in the CISPR uh, subcommittee uh, for household appliances. And the second one is the so-called systems approach, conformity assessment activities within the systems approach. Such an award also means that you and your company um, are heavily engaged in IEC work. What are the reasons, what is the m your motivation to do so? A BSH uh, Home Appliances is a global acting company. And therefore we uh, very much support the IEC vision, one standard, one test accepted everywhere, accepted worldwide. And this is needed uh, to accomplish our products uh, as quick as possible for market access. So if we do understand you right, uh, you do consider the IEC to be a success story. Are there any important challenges relevant to the future to IEC? Yes, I think so. I'm 100% convinced uh, that we will have in the near future more and more uh, products with communication interfaces. So and these products uh, will be elements of the smart uh, grid, uh, smart home, smart buildings, internet of things, internet of services. And uh, the ISC provides with the systems approach, the tools and the processes to deal with these issues. Wonderful. Mr. Kampet, thank you very much and congratulations again. Thank Wonderful. you very much again. This year's winner of the highest IEC tribute, the Lord Kelvin Award, Mr. Uwe Kampet. Hello, Uwe. Hello, Friedrich. Congratulations for this prestigious award uh, of the uh, IEC mm -hmm. and welcome in the Lord Calvin uh, Club. Thank you. I think that's worth that we both together have now a drink at the bar. Yep. Good idea. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this was Mr. Harless and he is the winner of the Lord Calvin Award 2012. And I guess that's another way of living our motto, connecting. IEC General Meeting 2016. Connecting communities. Reinvent standardization.